so yesterday it was revealed that J.K. Simmons will be portraying Commissioner Gordon in the Justice League movie. I'm really happy to see that Commissioner Gordon is going to be in the DC Extended Universe because there were rumors going around that Commissioner Gordon at this point in the DC Extended Universe was going to be deceased. So I am really happy that he's going to be showing up in this universe. To me, he is such an important, you know, key element to the DC Universe, kind of like the way the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. is to the Marvel Universe, in that, that they represent the normal people, the people without superpowers, the people like you and I, the normal people. Although I don't know, like, how many, like, normal people have to deal with a guy that dresses up like a bat every day and a psychopathic killer clown, but, you know, I don't know, people have adventurous lives, I guess. J.K. Simmons was, like, never, like, you know, my first choice to play Commissioner Gordon. I never pictured him in that role, but... Like, now that I think about it, and, like, I looked at some of the pictures from the comics of Commissioner Gordon and the cartoon that I used to watch when I was a kid, Batman the Animated Series, I look at it, it fits. Like, he, it can work. I think that he will be a good Commissioner Gordon. I really do. I know a lot of people know, like, J.K. Simmons as, you know, J. Jonah Jameson, which he did a perfect job as J. Jonah Jameson, but people don't realize that he actually is a very good actor. Like, I think that he is most well known, though, for, like, maybe his more comedic things, like, you know, J. Jonah Jameson and, like, playing, um, in the Farmers commercials, I think. It'll be really nice to see him in this universe. It's just, like, makes me wonder, though, what's he going to be doing in Justice League? It would have made more sense for him to be introduced in Batman v Superman, but, you know... Whatever, you know, plays out. Like, they didn't have anybody probably cast for the role, and it's too late to, you know, shoehorn him in to Batman v Superman. You don't want him to be shoehorned in, because then that wouldn't be fair to the character. Maybe we might see him show up in Suicide Squad, though, and, like, maybe the flashback was Batman. That would be really cool. I think that, you know, like, there would be a good time to, like, introduce, like, you know, with the Joker and everything and Harley Quinn. It would be appropriate to have him in the Suicide Squad. But again, like, the Suicide Squad probably is too far along for them to shoehorn in Commissioner Gordon. I am here hearing rumors though that he will be mentioned throughout Batman v Superman and there are also rumors that he's going to be retired at this time maybe he comes out of retirement you know just that now that Batman like the whole superhero thing is starting to take off in the DC extended universe either way like he's got big shoes to fill though because like Gary Oldman like did such a great job as Commissioner Gordon at slash Lieutenant Gordon and you know in the Christopher Nolan Batman movie so he does have big shoes to fill but JK Simmons is such a good actor I know that he can perfectly fill that role now the only only question left is who's gonna play J. Jonah Jameson in the new Spider-Man movie? I know there's like some people that are saying that Ice Cube would be good and you know Ice Cube I'm usually really a big stickler about finding you know you know sticking to the comics as close as possible but then every once in a while you find an actor that just fits the role so well like kind of like Michael Clark Duncan with the Kingpin or you know even Lawrence Fishburne playing Perry White that fits really well. Ice Cube is J. Jonah Jameson? It can work. I can see it. So anyway, I just wanted to talk about this. I'm really excited for this, you know, that we got our Commissioner Gordon for the DC Extended Universe. So as always, if you like what you see, go and hit subscribe, follow me on Facebook and Twitter. The links are in the description below. And remember, I waste my money so you don't have to. Thanks for watching.